What is the best place to live in Dominican Republic? Every time that I read this question, the first reaction that I get is, hmm, I don't know. I don't know you. I don't know what you like. I don't know your hobbies. And for that reason, I cannot give you an accurate answer. I know Dominican Republic is an island. And every time somebody thinks about an island, they think it's small. And it is a small, but it's also the second largest island in the Caribbean. So let me give you an example of how big the island is. The total land area, it is 19,000 square miles. This is equivalent to Massachusetts, Connecticut, Rhode Island, and Delaware all put together. So it doesn't seem that small after all. I say this because it is several types of lifestyle that someone can live in an island this size. Most people believe that the only lifestyle that you can live is beach lifestyle which is not true. The south, the east, and the north part of the island are all surrounded by water. So if you like the beach life, you can live the lifestyle around these areas. The island also have many inland cities. They have no access to beaches if you are into the lifestyle as well. So having said that, what is the best area or city for you to live here in Dominican Republic? But before we get into that, let's break down the four most common type of living here in Dominican Republic. Number one, the beach lifestyle. As I mentioned before, this one is the most popular among the foreigners here in Dominican Republic. Number two, the city lifestyle, which is the second most popular. Number three, the ecological lifestyle. And number four, the campo lifestyle. So we are gonna discuss all four and in which series or area fall into this category so you can have a better understanding thereby making the right decision for you. So let's start with the first one, beach lifestyle, which is self-explanatory. This is for people that are looking for town or city near the beach. So what city or town do I recommend for someone that is looking for a beach lifestyle? Keep in mind that the beach lifestyle can be broken down in two types, busy beach lifestyle and quiet beach lifestyle. So let's start with the busy beach. Cities like Punta Cana, Puerto Plata, Sosua, Cabarete, Boca Chica, La Romana, Las Terrenas, just to name a few, all are beach cities but very popular among foreigners. Now if you are looking for a quiet beach town, I recommend cities like Nagua, Valle Ibe, Barahona, Las Galeras, Rio San Juan, and some areas in Samana. So now let's move on to city lifestyle. This lifestyle is for people that like things more fast-paced, more convenience, more variety, more cultural things like city like Santo Domingo and Santiago are on top of the list. As you know, these are the two largest cities here in Dominican Republic. Santo Domingo with a population of over 3 million people and Santiago over 1.5 million people. Both cities have everything you want. Supermarkets, malls, hospitals, hotels, casinos, airports, and more. Just like the beach lifestyle, the city lifestyle can be divided in two types. There are also smaller cities. They have all the conveniences that you need, but in a small scale. Cities like Igüey, San Cristobal, San Pedro de Macorís, you can add Puerto Plata and La Romana in this category. Even though that we use this city in the beach lifestyle, they are still nice sized cities that you can have all the conveniences that you need. So now let's move on to the ecological lifestyle. This is for people that enjoy nature, river, mountain, waterfall, and valley. Some of the most popular cities for this are Jarabacoa, Constanza, La Vega, Samana, and El Valle. These areas are known for the natural habitat, beautiful mountain and waterfall. And the last one is the Campo lifestyle. This is for people that want to live a quiet and a slow life. Know a lot of people, doesn't need all the conveniences, and you can find these places all over the island. For some of the most popular places are some places in San Juan de la Maguana, Cabrera, Ato Mayor del Rey, Monte Plata, Bonao, Maimon, 
amount. Are some examples of campo here in Dominican Republic. I know that I left a lot of campos out, but these are just some examples. As you can see, depending on the lifestyle that you want to live, you can find the city that works the best for you. This is why when I get this question, it's so hard for me to answer because it is so many options that you can choose from. So the first thing that you want to do when choosing an area is to find out which lifestyle fits your personality and what you want. Once you're able to do that, you will be able to narrow down your options. Also, keep in mind your monthly budget when doing this. The city lifestyle and the busy beach lifestyle being the most expensive of all four. So you're probably asking, what is the average cost of living in this full lifestyle? And the answer is, it's difficult because it's depending on the city. Once you choose the city, it's easy to do the research to find out the cost of living of that area. So now that you know this information, leave a comment below saying what city and lifestyle fits you the best. Because right now, my life or our lifestyle is the busy city, Santo Domingo. <laughs> so this is all I have for right now. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next one. Bye. This is equivalent to Delaware, Massachusetts, Connecticut, and Rhode Island all together. So it doesn't seem that small after all, huh? It wasn't that good at the end. I say this because there are several types of lifestyle that people can live in a life. I say this because there is types. Okay. So with that being said, what is the best area or city for you to live here in Dominican Republic? But before we get into that, let's break down the four most common life. So we are going to discuss these four and which areas or cities this category for that you can have a better understanding. Understand this. Understand this. Talk about is the ecological lifestyle. This is for people enjoying the nature, like mountain, rivers, waterfall. What else? And the last one is the campo lifestyle. This is for people that are looking for a. For one, are some examples of campos here in Dominican Republic. I know that I left a lot of campos out, but what? So let's start with the first one, beach. So let's start with the oh, first beach one. beach lifestyle. Nien, <laughs> please. I was say that one is a beach. Okay, so let's start with the first one, beach lifestyle, which is self-explanatory. Man, because you're telling me, you need to leave, leave me alone, please. Okay. 